Hello, this is Miss Augustine, and today I'm going to walk you through how to use the FET balancing simulation. And so if I scroll down, this link will take me to the balancing lab. And so now what we're going to do is we're going to begin with the introduction. And so for the introduction, we're going to be looking at this equation and trying to use these little numbers to make them balance. And there are some tools that we can use. So I like to use this one. There's a balance, but I think that this one is easier because it's going to just tell you yes or no whether you're balanced. So now you'll notice that we have zeros as coefficients. So if I put the arrow up and I make a 1, and then I make a 1 here, and I make a 1 here. Now I have two nitrogens, two hydrogens, one nitrogen on this side, and three hydrogens on this side. So I'm going to notice that there's a 3 and a 2, so I'm going to make this a 2 and this, excuse me, this a 3 and this a 2. So what I've done is I've taken the 3 here and put it here and the 2 here and put it here using like math skills and now you'll see that it balanced and so it's good. So then you would go through and do the other two. And then I would go now to playing the game. This is the practicing. And I've turned the timer off because nobody needs that. And in level 1, what you would be doing is, again, you would be going through and using your little coefficients to balance these reactions. Now, I'm going to point out that these are random, and so before you go on to the next one, you're going to type in which one you did into that document that I've given you. And then start over. You could finish that one and go to level two. Same deal. You're going to go through and use the coefficients and make sure that you copy down which one you did before you move on. And then finally, you'll go to level three. And again, they're random, so the one that you're doing might be different than the one that the guy sitting next to you is doing. Um, but just make sure that you copy it down into the document. And that's pretty much it. So if you wanted to, at some point, take a screenshot, if you go down to the bottom in this little FET logo, you can actually do a screenshot here if you wanted to. So if you wanted to get fancy and let's say you balance this one as 1 and 2 and 1, you'd need another one of these. And then this is 2, this is 2, this is 2, check and it's balanced. So let's say I wanted to stop right there and do a screenshot here. I could do that and then that would give me my, um, let's see, sorry, open my screenshot. And so if you wanted to do it that way and save them, that's fine too. And then you could keep going and then you could just copy this into, for instance, your document. So anyway, I'm going to hit the start over. I'm going to go back to home and I'm going to say this is Miss Augustine signing off.